Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I am Helena Nista, a sex therapist and a Tantra practitioner. And today's video is going to be a bit different because I decided to invite you to my bedroom <laughs> and to answer some of the more personal questions that you guys keep asking me uh, in the comments under my videos. And this is because something quite exciting has been happening over the last few months. My YouTube channel started to really take off and over the last few months I gained a lot of new subscribers. So thank you so much for watching my videos, for subscribing to my channel, for liking and for commenting. I already feel like I've been connecting with some of you on a more personal level in the comments because I really love to read them and respond to them. So thank you so much and you guys know who you are. <laughs> And I really feel like now is the time to actually introduce myself properly and to address all those things that so many of you have been curious about when it comes to me personally. Because I love answering all those questions about sex and intimacy and Tantra and all the other questions you keep asking me, but I want to also give you a more of a personal perspective of who I am as a, as a woman. <laughs> so that's what this video is about. And I think I'm going to call it Sex with Helena since we are in my bed, in my bedroom right now. Tell me if you like that name or if you have other suggestions. I think this is gonna be a really, really cool thing to do. Let me know what you think some more personal talks with me should be called. Or maybe you like sex with Helena or maybe you feel like something else will be more appropriate. This is a question I keep getting all the time and I guess this is because of my accent, because most of you can tell I'm not a native English speaker and I was not born in an, in an English speaking country. I was born in Poland. Um, I spent a big chunk of my life. I was raised in Poland, so Polish is my native language. But then I moved to Ireland and I lived in Ireland for four and a half years and I loved my time there. If you get a chance to go to Ireland, you definitely should. It's a beautiful, magical place. And then in 2009, I moved to Australia. First I lived in uh, in Melbourne for eight and a half years, then I moved to Barron Bay for a while, then I was in Sydney for a year, and now I am based on the beautiful, gorgeous Gold Coast. People usually think I'm French or uh, that I'm from South America, but I am actually born and raised in Poland and currently living in Australia. Another big, big question I get from many of you is, are you single? This is obviously a tricky question because things change in my life so depending on when you're watching this video i'm filming it in october 2020 yes i'm currently single i am dating though and hoping that my relationship status will change but currently single another thing that a lot of people want to know is how i became a sex therapist and I can understand the curiosity. It's not a usual career path. It's not usually something that we decide as a child. I wasn't five years old telling my mom that I, I was going to be a sexologist. That didn't happen, but it was my life's path that kind of took me there. I actually studied and trained as an accountant. So I am a certified accountant, um, but I had an accident. I had an accident in my sex life and I had quite a bit of sexual trauma from being with partners who um, weren't as sensitive to my sexual needs as I ideally would want them to. So all of that led me to a sexual crisis where eventually I was in so much pain because of sex that I had to be taken to the emergency room. And in that point, when I was coming back from the hospital, I realized that I could never have sex the same way again. And I started to, just for myself, I started to learn and explore the area of great sex and Tantra and sexual healing. It was such an amazing awakening for me to learn about all of these things and to actually experience the power of tantric practices and, and sexual exercises on my own body and my own orgasmic ability that when I became multi-orgasmic and full body orgasmic and I started to experience this profound ecstatic erotic states, I decided that I wanted to help others 
who were in a similar situation and others who wanted to expand and grow their own sexual potential. So that was a bit of a path where I became a bit of a wounded healer because I experienced such profound crisis when it comes to my own sexuality that then I had to go on a journey of healing and exploration. And on the other side of that path, I was able to help others. And I became a certified sexologist and, and a certified uh, counselor and therapist and a tantra practitioner, which is now all of these different modalities I'm bringing together to you in my videos. I'm going to throw in this one here for you briefly because a lot of you are asking me if you can work with me and how you can work with me. First of all, I have a range of online courses. You can access them through my website, helenanista.com. Um, I have a section also on my sessions. Yes, I'm available for one-on-one -on -one sessions. All over the world, I work through Zoom and, um, and I work with clients in many different countries at the moment. Some of you have been asking if I get turned on when I'm filming, when I'm talking about all of these erotic, orgasmic, sexual topics? Well, no, not really. <laughs> because when I teach, when I talk about them, I'm much more focused on the delivery of the video because there's obviously quite a few steps that come into creating a, a finished video that you see on YouTube. So at that point, I'm not exactly getting turned on. My mind is just focused on delivering my content in the best way possible so that it serves you in the best possible way. I have vast knowledge when it comes to sexuality, so I need to make sure that I don't go on for hours <laughs> talking about all these topics that I am so, so passionate about. I do also get a lot of requests for uh, practical demonstrations of things I teach. Well, first of all, my channel is educational. I am a therapist and I'm a sex educator. I teach about this kind of things. If you are looking for porn, please go somewhere else. This is not what I deliver. Please don't ask me to demonstrate things on actual body parts because I I am not going to do that. Besides, YouTube won't let me because YouTube's rules and regulations are such that we YouTubers cannot publish certain content, especially when it's explicit sexual content. I value this YouTube platform that I can use to connect with all of you guys, with people all over the world, so I won't be risking uh, my, my YouTube account by publishing anything explicit. And besides, this is really not who I am. I don't produce porn. I have no problems with that, but that's just not who I am. This is not what I do. What you see on YouTube is who I am, and this is how I'm going to continue sharing my content. This concludes a first edition of Sex with Helena, <laughs> where I invite you guys to my bedroom, to my bed, uh, for a more personal chat about me, who I am, and my life. I intend to create these videos on some kind of regular basis, maybe once a month, depending on what feels right but on a much more regular basis, I'm going to keep producing and creating my educational videos because that's where my passion is and because that's what I love doing and that's what the world really needs, proper quality sexual education. So please keep sending me your questions. Please keep letting me know what kind of content and information you desire and want so I can keep producing that. And for now, I'm going to wrap this up. So please make sure to keep watching my other amazing, fun, educational videos because I keep pouring my heart and soul into them. <laughs>